Today, uh, we reported the third known uh, case of HIV remission and the first woman following a stem cell transplant using HIV resistant cells or as known CCR5 Delta 32 homozygous. So this case is special for several reasons. First, our, our participant was a US woman um, living with HIV of mixed race who needed a stem cell transplant for treatment of her leukemia. And she would find a more difficult time finding both a genetic match and one with the HIV resistant mu mutation to both cure her cancer and potentially her HIV. This is a natural but rare mutation and more common in Northern European, more like 1% in that group. So the cord blood cells have the advantage of being more forgiving in terms of genetic match and have left less graft versus host disease. They also have fewer cells for an adult sized patient. So luckily she had several HIV resistant cord units with an adequate genetic match. So in this case, uh, we combined a resistant cord with a half match from an adult relative donor, which allowed faster recovery. So similar to the Berlin and London patients, our participant had cancer requiring a stem cell transplant and received these naturally HIV resistant cells, but in our case, cord blood instead of adult donors. She did not experience some of the problems of graft versus host as they did, and she became HIV antibody negative by one year, HIV DNA negative, and had no HIV cultures positive post-transplant, even when off HIV. Uh, I mean, off ARV, sorry. Um, so she, to date, fulfills the profile of HIV remission as previous reports of cure 